going to be doing an unboxing and showing you guys some products that I purchased that I'm really excited. I am gearing up for the Halloween season, so I wanted to um, make some purchases of some kind of like fall slash Halloween-esque themed bath products that I want to demo for you guys, things I thought would be um, nice and interesting that I thought you would like to see. So I'm really excited. I'm just kind of like, um, like I said, kind of looking around Etsy and places like that to find some interesting products to demo and show you guys. So I'm really excited about that because Halloween is like my favorite holiday ever. So the first thing that I purchased, I got three bath bombs from the Ticklish Draft, and they're in these super cute containers. They look like pudding cups, almost. Um, these are $6.50 a piece. I got all three that they made. Um, this first one is called The Dark Side. It is a deadly, deadly bath bomb with intensive colors. So these are going to be those super dark, um, bright rich colors that are so popular right now and I'm just loving this packaging um, it looks like a little pudding cup this one is red and like I said it's called the dark side and it smells really nice it is scented with blood orange grapefruit patchouli and dark moss so that's gonna be really exciting to do I am really excited to do these baths like I was like I can't wait much longer um, so I'm probably soon going to start doing some demos of these more like Halloween-esque um, bath products soon because I just I can't wait much longer. Um, this next one is called the Alien Bath Bomb and this one is green. I just have it like opened just a tiny bit so I can get a good sniff. This is scented as candy corn so that's really awesome I love the smell of candy corn so that's what the green one looks like and then the other one that they have is called the toxic bath bomb and this one is orange oh wow that smells so good it is described as an orange sherbet smell and I just love these I think they're so freaking cute so I purchased those recently and I'm just been dying to try one out. Um, and I'm also going to show you guys an order I placed with Moon's Harvest. They came out with their new um, fall collection. So I wanted to show you what I decided to buy. I don't buy like everything in the collections. I just kind of buy what I think would be um, the best products that um, to show as far as like um, the cutest, the most unique, and the best colored looking ones. So, um, these are just the ones that I decided on. So, so this collection is called Magical Woodlands. Super cute name for a collection. And the first bath bomb I purchased, and with all Moon's Harvest bath bombs, they're huge. They're like the biggest bath bombs I have ever had before. Um, this one... This just, just kind of gives you an inclination of how big they are. They're huge. Um, this one is called Pixie Shadows, and it retailed for $5.50. It's described as a spicy rose, pepper, and cinnamon. It just has a really unique, interesting smell. Moon's Harvest definitely has some interesting scented products. So I thought this would be a gorgeous colored bath with all of those pinks and dark um it looks like a dark purpley blue on the top so i'm really excited to try that this bath bomb oh my god like i was not expecting it to be this big but do you see how freaking big this is this one is called black angel nine which is an interesting name for a bath bomb but it is rose shaped and it's got some gorgeous color in there it's described as red berries, orange, and moss. Again, just a unique, interesting um, scent combination, but it smells really lovely, and I just cannot get over how huge this thing is. Our next product is a bubble bar, and this is so freaking cute. It is shaped like an owl, and her name is Ophelia, and she's just a really cute, pretty purple owl. Oh, and she smells so lovely. She's kind of got a derpy look to her 
face because her, her little um, beak is crooked, but that just makes her all the more cuter in my opinion. So she retails for $6.50, and again, a huge bubble bar. You could get multiple uses out of this bubble bar, but as you know, when I do a demo, I'm going to be using the entire thing, and it just has a gorgeous berry smell. Described as currants, huckleberry, blackberry, sage, pineapple, and clove, and it just has a beautiful smell. I definitely smell that berry mixed with that more like earthy kind of clove kind of smell. It smells so good. It's so freaking cute. I love her. I'm definitely in love with these. I also got another bubble bar and this one is called Changes and it retails for $6.50 and oops wrong side. Um, but it is a little fall leaf. Well not little it's huge. Um, but it is a fall leaf and I just thought this would be perfect for fall, a fall bath. Oh my goodness. And it smells so nice and crisp smelling. It's described as cherry blossom, musk, and tea blossoms. And it just smells so good. Like I said, it has a very crisp smell. Like a crisp autumn day with a little berry mixed in. Such a gorgeous smell. And I just love that. I think this is going to be a very, very nice bubble bar. Right, and I am so excited for this and I'm going to take it out of the packaging to show you guys a little better. But this is the pumpkin caramel sugar bath bomb with a cocoa butter melt. So it's a big pumpkin shaped bath bomb and then you got a little baby pumpkin that is the bath melt. It retails for $7.50 and it is huge. Let me get it out of here so you can see it a little better. And oh my goodness, this smells so good. Like this is the epitome of fall, the smell. It smells like the sweetest pumpkin scent. It smells, like I seriously cannot tell you guys enough how great this smells. Like if you were thinking about making a purchase on Moon's Harvest, you need to do it and you need to get this one here. Regardless of what it looks like in the bath right now, because I don't know since I haven't demoed it yet, you need it for the smell alone. And this thing is huge, so if you don't want to use the whole thing, you can cut it in like four pieces and get four baths out of it. And then it also comes with this tiny little baby pumpkin and this is the um, bath melt. So you can stick these in together or use them separate, um, what have you, but they are scented the same and they smell so, so good. So I am I'm dying to use these products. I'm so excited. They always send samples as well so you can kind of get an idea of other scents of the products that they offer if you have not, um, you know, purchased a bath bomb or other product that smells like it. So I love that, that you get a chance to smell other things. But this is a bath frosting, and it is in the scent Blue Moon. And this smells just like fabric softener. Like a, the Snuggle fabric softener. It has a very clean linen kind of smell. It smells really, really nice. Just like fabric softener. And then we also got a sample of Body Souffle, and this is in the scent Eve Rising. And this smells, mmm, this smells like a sweet, a really nice sweet scent. Gosh, that smells so good. It just has a really nice, pretty, um, almost like a sweet floral kind of smell. It smells beautiful. So anyway guys, that is my, um... Ticklish Giraffe and Moon's Harvest um, unboxing. Just wanted to share with you guys some of the products that I will be demoing um, in the next coming weeks and um, month. Um, like I said, I'm really excited to start um, doing some Halloween type baths. I also placed an order with the Mad Bombers. I pretty much bought like every almost every single um, item that they have to offer because it's all kind of like Halloween-esque and like I said I'm really gearing up towards Halloween and doing some 
demos of some super cool Halloween bath products. And I also purchased something from another Etsy shop as well. Um, it was just one thing, but it was super cute, and I just thought it would be, like, so awesome to do a video of. Um, so I'm definitely, if there's any places you can think of, or if you even have your own company, and you're making Halloween-y stuff, and you'd like to, um, have me demo it or anything like that, just hit me up. I have my address, my P.O. box in my description if it's, you know, it doesn't have to be Halloween thing, but like I said, right now is the time I'm like getting everything together to start doing some Halloween themed bath product demos so really excited for that um, but I hope you guys are excited for the Halloween season and all of these awesome products that I will be showcasing here in the next couple weeks and month because um, we are in September now and October is just around the corner so I'll probably start um, throwing in some Halloween-esque themed products um, before October because I don't know how much longer I can wait. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you next time.